Okay, we're going to start on build day three here for the car camping project. Um, I have taken all of the pieces out of the car and laid them out here on the ground so I can have everything flat and level, as close to flat and level as I can, um, so I can get the piano hinges attached to the main pieces um, so this thing will be convertible or foldable. I'm going to try to get those attached. Um, then do a dry run in the car to um, or fit in the car rather to um, make sure it's going to fit right and fold right and do what I need it to. Then I'm going to probably see about cutting the support legs for the front. So that's what we're doing today. Okay, that's one piano hinge attached to the main piece and the center piece. Now I gotta do the other end of the center piece and the head piece. into one mostly compact piece. Now we need to take that and put it in that and see how it fits.
fix that. Okay, got the base in the car, and it does fold out the way that it's supposed to. It's the right size. Let's grab a hold of that. That folds out like that. I had to move the seat up a little bit. The headpiece folds down like that. It's not 100% flat, but I really don't want it to be. Um, I mean, ideally, it would be, but the seats seats go up. Seats are elevated a bit, and that's okay. I don't mind it being a little slanted that way because I sleep on a adjustable bed at an incline anyway. Um, as of acid reflux and some other health conditions but oh, having it slightly elevated is fine it is in there it fits now I just need to climb up there on it and see how it's gonna do I have to put have to make some um, legs for to support the head up there on either side that is in. It folds right. It's a little off. Look, the braces are a little crooked. It's a little off, but it goes in. the The dimensions are correct, so it folds properly and goes back the way it's supposed to. Now, I am gonna have to put some type of handle or uh, of some sort on the back of here to make that easier to pull out i think some maybe just a thick piece of rope or something or so, some type of pull that i can grab a hold of and pull that up it's going to be too long to it's, it's too far of a reach to reach back to grab a hold of that but something kind of in the middle to grab and to open it up with but that's gonna work that is gonna work Twenty inches. Twenty inches. Just under twenty.
there we have support legs um, made out of 4 by 4s go underneath the headboard piece of the platform. Those will not be permanently fixed to that. What I think I'm going to end up doing is screwing a hole in the board here and down into the post there and then using um, drop pins just to keep it in place so it doesn't slide out of there. I think I'll do that on either side and um, that should work. I've seen it done. Well, that's really all I'm, all I'm after just to make sure that there's support under the head there and that the, the post don't fall out. in here, grab a hold of this, we pull that down like that, and we grab a hold of this head piece, and it folds out like that. And then we have a flat bed, or mostly flat bed. And then there'll be carpet on here. There'll be a mattress on here, and at some point, when I take a road trip, there'll be me on here sleeping. But this is working. This is cool. I'm happy. <laughs>